fly with the blue and just keep it on that like coming soon or something that whatever the, the green screen that i showed you yeah on the left i got you all right I'm and then, like i said it'll probably take a lot of it through i don't know why i was doing that earlier all right i think i'm set right now all right cool i'll check it out all right see ya please Damn, you shouldn't go before you say bye. So, like, how does the thing work? Hmm? How does that work? Like, you have to, like, push the button to speak? Nah, no, just, it's on now. So, what, when you're in that, when you're announcing? I'll just you? be here and I'll be like, uh, great save by Timmy, and... <laughs> <laughs> what's that beautiful ball, man? I was gonna say what's up to the kickers and them. Great news, that, yeah, I'll oh, go down with, I'll go down with you right now. So, you know everybody in the kickers, though, right? Yeah.
What if it's dark? Do you have like a brightening setting? Uh, like the ISO. The filter on the side, right? Left side, try different filters. Um, oh, I see. It is on auto. All right, this is pretty good now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For time-wise. All right, I got you. All right. I don't know, do they expect there to be music? Because I don't have music. <laughs> Can you go to YouTube and make sure? Ready? Yeah. <clears throat> Can you give me my water? <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are out here. It's a beautiful night out here in Catonsville. As we prepare to see Baltimore Kickers face off with Ambitions FC. Coach Marlin feels that he has set his team up for success tonight. And Coach Len, representing the Kickers in the yellow, he feels that his boys are equally as prepared to not only defend their goal, but also score. We are underway. As Roy seems to play it back to Eddie, who finds John out on the left. They find Herman Sasha, who pivots out. And they go back to their goalkeeper, Timmy. Eddie with a beautiful ball out here. The Nair, number eight. Finds his winger out wide. Roy plays it up. Oh, here comes the Nair. With the ball, finds his right back. He's under pressure. Quickly releases the ball. Herman out here in space. And Ambition continues their press, shifting over to the right side of the field. Kickers with a beautiful spurt of possession here. They play it over the top, and unfortunately that possession comes to an end. Ambitions continues the play by playing it out the back. He's looking for his runners. Let's see who he finds. He finds his number six. His midfielder who likes to play it right back to him. Goalkeeper Lucas plays a similar ball to the midfield, except this time he chooses to dribble. Herman Sasha steals the ball, plays it up to Charlie, who finishes beautifully in the right corner. Great work, Charlie. That is a great goal there early on for the Baltimore Kickers. Great steal from Herman Sasha, who quickly plays it over to Charlie. Who takes one touch and a finish to get the goal. Baltimore kickers up 1-0. Let's see how Ambitions chooses to respond here.
Great show of skill there. Ball, quick little wall pass there for Ambitions. He keeps the ball. Releases. Looks long. But the kicker's defense is able to stop that in its tracks. He gets through the traffic. Oh, quick little short ball there. And kickers are on the counter. Denaire plays a quick ball through to a winger with extreme pace is able to find it. One-on-one -on -one situation here. They are in the box, a collision, but the ref says play on. And he comes in, headers it back to John, who finds Denaire. Back to Herman. And out wide to their right back. Ambition's upset with that call, but it is a free kick for the kickers at about the 20-yard mark. Let's see if they can take advantage here. Three-man wall here for Ambitions, who presses and blocks the play before it can come to anything significant. Thrown here for the boys in yellow. They are under pressure, a quick turn in of cross into the box. Defender finds it. Beautiful play here. Charlie lays it off. They are calling a foul. Unfortunately, the refs do not agree. Here we go. Short ball here for the kickers. One that is stopped by their right back. Ball still in play here. Ambitions looks long. Can they find their attacker? Daniel unfortunately unable to find and maintain the, the ball. Sanjay wins the ball and wins the foul. Sanjay setting up his kick, looking to see if they can get that goal to equalize against these kickers. We're currently able to string a few passes along on each of their possessions. Fourteen presses the ball. They try to slow him down on the wing. They win the ball back. Sanjay here. Maintains possession after a little scuffle. And a great ball over the top. Looking for his shot. It is blocked by John, but the play is not dead. Herman comes in. And the deflection goes out of bounds. Four corner kick. Great opportunity there for Ambitions FC. Yeah. 
Players are marked up. Ball goes over far post. Close to a target, unable to find the right make of contact to get a shot on goal. Denaire here plays it out to Herman, who's under pressure. Daniel presses the ball, forces the kickers back to their goalkeeper. Timmy with a quick one-touch play. A beautiful ball up to their midfielder, Denaire. Eddie looks long again as Charlie's running back. Four ambition defenders back here. They slow him up long enough to give their players time to get back behind the ball. And a corner kick for the kickers. Kickers looking to further their lead here. So ball is played in. It's high and it's won by number four on Ambition FC. A shot is taken, kept low, but wide enough to miss the target. Sanjay finds the ball in the midfield. He's unpossessed. A free kick here at half field for the kickers. Eddie plays it up, top of the box. It's won by the right back. Great composure by the center back. Finds his winger who looks up to Charlie who takes a shot and does not find the back of the net on there. Wide but great play there by the kickers. Great defensive work by the goalkeeper by forcing the attacker out wide. Finds the ball up to a center back who takes his space. Finds the winger out wide. And seems to have been a ball meant for Roy. Who will take advantage of this throw in here. Lucas, the goalkeeper for Ambitions FC is setting his team up to thwart this attempt. They stop the attack, they clear it out. Ball resets all the way back to Timmy Askmar. Ball to Herman, who's clear in space in the midfield. Ambition FC taking a more of a low press attack. Maintaining their lines close enough to the back to make it difficult for the kickers to advance past the 40 yard mark. But they maintain possession here. They find their player, Denaire, with another pass here. 
Beautiful play here by the Baltimore Kickers. Showing patience and skill, executing great passes there. Coach Lan is certainly happy with his boys who are performing well today. Ambition plays short here. Great idea for the back heel. Unfortunately, Herman or it seems that was Denair who was able to intercept that ball. A shot and another goal there for the kickers. Number 11 for the kickers. Robbie, who is uh, somewhat newer to the team, but seems to be finding his footing just fine. We're 14 minutes in and Baltimore kickers lead 2-0. Ambition looking to respond quickly. The ball out wide. One on one with the defender. He finds a great shot to the left, but Tammy Ostermeyer again finding a beautiful save. Showing why he was named one of the better goalkeepers to come through at Lycoming College during his time there. Charlie out here running, looking to see if he can make a play. John here looks and finds Sean. They're looking for a foul, they get it. Sean faking a short play, a quick one. Ambition looking to see if they can organize themselves to prevent another goal from being scored. The crowd showing their support here. Ball gets played in, far post. Can the keeper come up? He does enough. Seems to be a corner for the kickers here. So they're not out of danger just yet. Ball is played in. It bounces at the top. A few short passes. They look far post. They maintain possession. Ambition looking to keep them out of their box. They pressure hard, they win the ball back. Can they keep it in? Nico under pressure. Embodies the ball, shielding it long enough for the ball to go out for another Baltimore kicker's throw in. Ball has played a great spin. He's into space. He's got players in the box. He shoots and a goal. Incredible stuff there. For Clay. Clay scoring the third goal here for the Baltimore Kickers. It seems to just be their day. They seem to be the team to beat here. Daniel plays outright to number four. 
Center back, looking for his option, finds his left back. They're under pressure right away with great little skill to get past the press. He goes for a second. He continues his dribble and plays a great ball down to the corner. Can ambition do something with this? They're looking to get a shot off. That can get them closer to coming back into this game. An offside call stops that play from ending the way they were hoping, which would have been a goal. Timmy plays short ball here to Nico. Who is not under a lot of pressure here. Ambition slowly inching their way up and they press quickly. Timmy gets the ball off his feet and finds his center forward, Charlie. Who's got Robbie playing a ball over the top. Roy here finds Carmo out right, losing the ball, but it wins it right back. He's under pressure. A foul is called. Will they play it quickly? They choose to give themselves time to set up to find their fourth goal of the game. Quite the first half we've had today. With plenty of time still left to go. Ball finds the PK mark. And Sean takes the shot that goes over, hitting the field goal post. Ball is in, they play it short. They find their winger, who holds on a bit too long, losing the ball here. And he switches the ball to John, who's under pressure here. The play goes on. Clay finds Denaire, he links up with Herman. Herman looking to play it out to the other side. Nico dribbles, takes his space. Looking to find Sean, it seems. Just a bit too much. Lucas plays short again here. Ambition seeming to struggle to get out of their back. Long ball finds their winger who fights to keep the ball. Left back here. Lines 14 who dribbles by a few players. Herman under pressure. Finds Eddie who clears the ball over the top, giving it some time to reset. Karma spins out, but unfortunately surrounded by ambition players looking to steal the ball back. Daniel keeps the ball. Number seven loses it quickly and a ball is played over the top Charlie one on one Lucas goalkeeper for ambition does great to come out and save the day a battle in the air 
Finds Lucas winning the ball right back. Lucas looking long here. Nico finds the ball once it hits the ground. He finds Denair. Robbie plays it through. Charlie. And Carmo plays a quick ball, looking to try to find an air in the box. But the ambition defenders clear it out before it can make it to him. Throwing comes in. Unfortunately, it comes down to nothing for the kickers. Let's see if Ambition FC can turn the tables here before the half ends. Sanjay for Ambition FC. Such as for space. Loses the ball but keeps possession with the throw in. Play a short ball here. Free kick here for kickers as their players look to push up the field. Hungry for that fourth goal. Eddie wins in the air. Sanjay in the midfield. Pokes it over top, wins it again. Goes in the air. Toppling over the center midfielder for kickers. Clay here. Looking to take space down the side. And a great tackle here for the ambition at center back. Seems to be some sort of shin related injury. Zoom play here. Clay is at the top of the box here. Get a great crowd out here tonight. There's nothing better to do on a Sunday than to watch an MMSSL game. MSSL. Corner kick here. They play top of the box here, looking to find Herman. Daniel seems to win the ball here as they are attacking quickly. He dribbles his way forward. Unfortunately, Ambition is not able to capitalize on this counterattack. Kicker's doing just enough to stop them in their tracks. John connects short. Robbie looking for his left back. Short ball here. They reset back to their goalkeeper. Switch their point of attack and try their luck on this left side. 
<laughs> Sanjay with the ball. Nico going back to Eddie, who searches for his options, finds the right side. Carmo now with the ball. Who goes back to Roy? Who goes back to Nico here? Kicker is just playing the ball around, trying to find space. Tim with a quick, short, quick, long ball. Pickers win the ball back here. Daniel comes out to press. Ambition closing down here as they approach midfield. However, Kicker was with a series of passes, makes their way up. Seems to have been some sort of clash of heads here in the previous play. But we continue, all players seem to be all right. Beautiful ball down here. Eddie forced to retreat back to his goalkeeper. Timmy playing another confident one-time play to Nico, who gets past his first defender, unable to get past the second line of pressure. Daniel here, seeing if he can find himself a shot or a player that can get their team back into this game. A tackle and a foul, it seems, has been committed. We have ourselves a penalty kick here. Sanjay with Ambition FC up against Timmy O. Oh. Who gets beat down the center? Ambition with their first goal here. Looking to try to make a comeback. Can they do it? What a half. Four goals and we still have what seems to be about 15 minutes left in this half. The stakes are high as Baltimore Kickers looks to maintain their position at the top of the table. And Ambition looks to take away that spot. Let's see how both teams respond here. Sean here, finds his shot, blocked here. Charlie looks to play it out to Robbie out right. Quick combination, AT finding Charlie once again, who takes a left-footed shot there. Not enough for Lucas, who makes the save.
Lucas plays this ball to the top of the circle. Sanjay battling between two kicker players, gets through, finds a ball out to the corner across the top of the box here. Ambition looking to score their second goal. Timmy makes a great save there, securing the back of the net for the kickers. A short ball here to Nico. Taking the space that Ambition is giving him. In no real rush here. Kickers just looks to be maintaining possession, confident that they'll find the pockets of space to attack. Ambition, though, doing a great job at winning the ball back here, maintaining their press. The ball to the top of the box here. A shot that goes wide. Ambition seeming to have gotten confidence from their first goal here. Taking it, in it two Baltimore kickers. The crowd continues to support Baltimore kickers as they have a huge fan base. A few players out here coming out to watch them play. Substitution here. As Ambrose comes in, or Clay, it seems. Kickers connecting passes here. Once again, a ball is played over the top. Lucas finds this comfortably. Cheeky pass here. Number four, having a great game here, despite the score. AT looks to win this ball back. Nice little nutmeg here, but Ambition once again finding the ball. Quick play here. No with the ball out left. Takes a big touch, but is able to keep possession. We have a 2v3 situation here. And kickers with the numbers stops the play. Coach Len urging his players to keep the intensity throughout this half. Despite being up two goals here, there is plenty of time left in this game. It could be anyone's game here. As in the Maryland Super Soccer League, you never know. What's next? Ambition looking to get their attack started. Nico finds and intercepts the final pass. Ambition winning it up higher up in the field here. They look to pressure. The defender shielding it perfectly. Eddie here finding Nico, who's in space once again. Simple pass here up to Sean, who finds John running it down the left flank. 
all goes seems to have been attempted at shot an ambitious one but one the goalkeeper was able to stop kicker still here in the attack Lucas making the save but kickers seem to be getting more momentum as they search for their fourth goal of the half Set of great passes there. Lead kickers to another shot. Unfortunately, a little bit off target. They do get the corner kick here. Also joined here by Patrick Aguru, Baltimore kickers player. Patrick, what do you think of the game so far? Which one of these teams do you think uh, has had the upper half, upper hand this half? I'd say. Uh... Kickers, the kickers so far showing quality footwork you know, on the ball. Pretty confident in the ball too. But. Yes, they have been able to secure possession for longer moments of the game. And a long distance shot here from AT. Patrick, with your experience playing the kickers, which one of these uh, players is the one to watch? The one to watch? For the kickers of their players on the field right now. Mm. One to watch would be AT, center defensive mid. Pretty solid on the ball. Very strong. He looks to prevent Ambition FC from scoring any more. Great opportunity here for Ambition. The boys in black find an opportunity to score. It's up in the air. Cleared but not out of danger just yet. Charlie coming back. Sean. Correction, Sean comes back there looking to try to press. Great header here. <laughs> Ambrose. Not Ambrose. James. AT finds John. A great ball down the line. And a tackle to stop the kickers in their tracks. Sub here for the kickers. Sean has come off in exchange for someone. John with the throw in. Places at the top of the box. Ellis with a beautiful volley. Claims a deflection. The referees agree. Corner kick for the kickers here. Some in the crowd seem to be upset with that call. Some seem to be quite happy. What do you think, Pat? Was that a corner kick? I think I saw a little bit of a deflection on there, so it's just a rough call, you know. Corner kick here. Comes in. Ellis looks to keep this ball in play. But the counter continues. Nico stops it in his tracks once again. Also one to watch. Nico making his way to the other end of the field to maintain pressure on the ambition. Players with the ball. Lucas finds his left winger. 
The kickers are right on their touch. A scuffle seems to have arose. Tensions are heating up here. As we come to the close of the first half, kickers lead three to one. Goes in. Herman unable to keep the ball. That's AT. AT un unable to keep the ball. Another shot and deflection. Corner kick here once again for the kickers as they set up. Ambition so far doing good enough to defend the majority of these corner kicks. As they found themselves in this situation quite a few times here tonight. Goalkeeper here not happy with that call. He believes it was a goal kick. AT lining up here for the corner kick. Referee not happy with him knocking over that cone. AT does go ahead and replace his cone into the corner. Bit of confusion here. Oh, beautiful header here. Goes back into a kicker's unfortunately unable to produce a goal for them. Lucas plays it short and quick. Ambition here, quite often tonight, playing it quick and short. building up here looking for something unfortunately they lose the ball here at the 20 and a call here gives the kickers a free kick in prime goal scoring range Pat what do you think they'll do here you think they'll take a shot or do you think a pass is a better Choice here. Um, for Charlie going for the shot, what do you think? Charlie plays it over the top to a few players running on. Lucas finding a runner, unfortunately losing the ball here. Kickers once again back in the corner looking to try to find a shot. Alice looking to keep him in. Sanjay here with the ball. Looking to try to get it out. He goes down. Not happy here with that challenge. That is the first half. Baltimore Kickers leading three to one. In quite a back and forth game. Kickers initially controlling the game for the majority of the first half. 
We will be right back with the second half. In just a sec. The ambition, ambition is getting a little bit agitated with each other. A little frustration there. I want to go play for that team. I'm going. Let me see what's up. I'm going down there. All right. Wait, so Clay is, is his name not Clay or is he just not speedy? He's both. It's a solid on the ball too. All right, so what's the issue? I don't know. They just, I don't know who's that actually. Is that the six, kicker's six, group chat? Yeah.
Here we go for the second half of this exciting game. Ambition down 3-1. Looking to try to mount a comeback in this second half. Kickers looking to maintain their lead, if not extend it. Kickers pressing high here. Putting a lot of pressure on their back line. Kicker wins the ball here. High up on the pitch. Throwing here across. Kickers here still with possession as the ambition defenders look to wrestle it away f from him. John looking to try to save the ball. Unable to. Ambition looking to try to get it out of their half here. To start their attack. The throw is in. John forces him out of bounds here to win the ball back. They drop it here. Ambrose keeping the ball. He looks long. Luke is here with the ball under pressure. Baker's winning a ball, uh, foul here. Seems two hands in the back as he went up to jump for the header. This game is very much alive and well here. Both teams battling it out for each inch. Ball goes long here. Eddie looking for a kicker. He finds him. As they look for their shot here. It is taken but blocked. Ellis fighting to keep the ball in their half. AT closing down with their right back. Nico comes to the rescue, offers up another option. Unfortunately, finds an ambition player. And that. Play is dead now, looking to counter here. Very back and forth, amazing tackle here from the defender here for Ambition FC. Throwing here. Charlie running onto this. Tripped up. 16. Edgar Diaz getting a talking to here as he sets up his one man wall. Charlie looks to play a low ball. Edgar here, looking for a one-on-one -on -one situation, finds himself in a 2v1 situation. Strong tackle here by AT. Ball is back in play here.
game is heating up here. As both teams know what is on the line and how valuable these three points would be to their team in the standings as they look to start on the right foot for their spring season. Free kick here for the kickers at the 40. Correction, closer to 30. This is quite a dangerous spot here. Edgar, the one-man wall, is enough to prevent the kickers from getting a goal in that last free kick. Short play once again here for Lucas, who gets the ball back. Quite a risky play here. Kicker's looking to take advantage. A play, uh, uh, the whistle is called. Is this a PK? Or will it be for ambition? Had ref looking to discuss things with his assistant. Ref, let's see what the developments are. Could he perhaps be deliberating a PK here for the kickers? Discussions continue. It seems that it is a penalty kick here. Matt Ellis, veteran to the kicker's team here. Confidently steps up to the plate to take this penalty kick. <laughs> Lucas stepping up here. Getting big to try to stop this penalty kick. And it is a beautiful penalty kick here for Matthew Ellis. Taking the momentum back. A fourth goal here for the kickers. They have been the first team to score in both halves. Can Ambition FC respond with another goal as they did in the first half? But they are going to need more than just one goal to get back into this game. Clay with an incredible amount of pace here. Goalie goes down here. We may need to hold the game for a second. Yellow card here for number 14. <laughs> the throw in here. One initially here by Ambition. Second ball, Edgar here. Looks to play a ball to the corner, over the top. John finds it with the head. Charlie finds it on the ground. As he quickly spins to keep possession of the ball. Ball goes out of bounds here. Pressing. 
Interesting development here. Edgar takes a long distance shot, which is blocked by Nico's head. Supporters from both sides out here tonight cheering their teams on. Ball finds Charlie who one times it over. Looking for one of his attackers here. Ambition does good to get it out of danger. Edgar here now drops it back. Number Number 11 here. Number 11 is. A, I'm, not, I'm just mistaken. Number 11 was Edgar Diaz. Under pressure, kickers. Ambrose, the defender, looks to clear it out to buy his team some time. Sanjay battling here. Ball is still in play. AT looking for space. Dangerous spot here for Ambition FC. Can they take advantage of this free kick and get themselves back into this game before it's too late? Timmy sets up his wall as he looks to be setting up a four-man wall here. Sanjay potentially looking to shoot here. He takes his shot. Goes over. Substitution here for the kickers. Sean's coming in. Seems that Sean is replacing Tommy. Tommy. Well, here advances here. Sean, one time shot here. Goes slightly wide, but immediately making an impact on this game upon entering in this half. Quick short ball here for Lucas as they go back to their center back, operating in tight corners. 50-50 ball here, goes the wrong way for Ambition. Kickers throw in in the corner. Are they done scoring? Kicker is looking for a cross, it goes in. Defender for Ambition does great to stop it before it crosses the six. Keeping the ball going forward in the right direction. But Nico sends it right back. Ooh, and off sides. Stops the counter attack for Ambition FC. Kickers here looking to make something happen. But Lucas comes out and plays it short here. AT with a long ball here. Great idea. But the keeper is quite wise to that coming out. Ooh, 
amazing battle here in the midfield tonight. That's both teams showing great effort in all 50-50 balls. Here comes Daniel sliding through the kickers. A great spin, but Ellis there to recuperate the ball for the boys in yellow. Long ball here, Sean in a pocket of space. Looks up to the goal, seeking his options, plays a quick move, is under pressure, chooses to cross it in a bicycle kick attempt. Good idea. That's a good idea from him. For the kickers. Sunday night is where you can catch some of the best soccer. Barrel with an acrobatic display of his athletic nature. Big ball here. Nico with players on his back. Timmy one times it. Close to his winger, unfortunately, closer to the out of bounds mark. game is still young. We are about two-thirds into this game now with only about 30 minutes left. Kicker is 4-1 to one leading. One-on-one -on -one that is deemed offside. Timmy coming out nonetheless for a great one-on-one -on -one save. Timmy Ostermeyer, newer to the kicker's roster, proving his colors, maintaining a clean sheet besides a penalty kick. Score. Bring me up to speed. What's going on here? Four to one for the Baltimore Kickers. The home side. Wow. What, ha what happened in the Rosozi Team United? It was one nothing. Yeah. Yeah. That was back and forth. A uh, great goalkeeper save though for a penalty kick. Oh yeah. Rosozi got a penalty kick and. Rosozi got a penalty kick and. Uh, got it. United got it blocked. Yeah. Yeah. Arsenal game. What's that? Arsenal game. Bro, I don't watch professional anymore. All I know is DMV Sports Media. That's the only <laughs> MSSL. The MSSL and everything else on the channel. <laughs> oh, well, that's not red. I put red. <laughs> Whatever. It's too late to change it now. I put red as the color for... Oh, well. They'll figure it out. It's not black. Uh-oh. Went down the line. Ambition clearing their lines, but not finding any possession. Sent out wide. Who's this in the near side? 18. Is it? Ambrose. What's it? What's Am his name? Ambrose. 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 Okay. Where's AT? AT's uh, sub dog. He was sub dog. Oh, okay. I think he might be coming in soon, anyways. Oh yeah. Finish off. It's a good clearance by Nico. You guys sound good on the uh, broadcast. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, he was helping out. Welcome everybody, for those who have been in, welcome, and those just joining, we are in the second half here at Catonsville High School, MSSL Division II action, K kickers leading by a score of 4-1, to one. we got a full slate of action on the day, this one's sent across, so oh, here's a chance, dancing, oh, and at the last, the tackle is made. Base, one sent forward. Sanjay Kareem gives chase. He might be offsides, but we'll never know. That one travels over the near touch. Looks like Ambition's added a few new pieces into the team. They don't look 
terrible. Looks, his kicker's just playing well. Yeah, kicker's balling out today. Kicker's definitely one of the front runners this season for promotion. I don't want to jinx it, but they're looking good. I'll just leave it at that. And haven't seen anyone who's risen to challenge them really from the field. NPC looks solid. Skyline pulled off a big come from behind win today, but still I think I like kicker's chances to be one of the two promoted teams. I do like those yellow kits though, they yeah. really pop. For once we don't have jersey conflict, like it's, I feel like the teams always make it so difficult. Only thing is I can barely tell the numbers on the back, uh, that makes mm -hmm. it tough. This one taken to the end line. Clay? Is there a finish? There's not. Good save. And all the way through, Potts sends it wide. You know this goalkeeper's name? Is this Tommy Potts? Timmy Hastemeyer. Timmy Hastemeyer, okay. I thought it was a Christos pickup. <laughs> I thought it was uh, Timmy Hastemeyer, okay. Never mind, it's not, not how I thought it was. Damn, look at your arm. Is that is that hurting you? <laughs> is it? What? Is, is it not? No, 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 that's fine. Is it, you don't mind it? Okay. I was gonna say I can fix it, but he's like turned like this. <laughs> he's got the broken oh, wrist. <laughs> and you're a trooper. <laughs> this one forward. Goalkeeper off his line. Good goalkeeping. You guess. Sniff that one out. Sent into the midfield, over the top again, it's Sanjay Kareem taking it to himself, still playing as Kareem, lovely bit of skill, but... Nico makes the stop. Yeah, I'm not sure what the appeal for the foul was, that was not, not a foul. Uh, at least that I saw. He wanted something. Yeah, maybe it was a handball, I didn't see. Oh good, he's on, looks like he's on. Yep, well-timed run. Is there a finish? Oh, there is, Que Golasso! And the celebration in the corner. 5-1 for the kickers. <laughs> there you got the, the cheering crew out, the famous cowbell cheering section. You gotta love it. And kickers on fire tonight. Good timing on that run. Yeah, it was a perfectly timed run. He did come from an onside position, but trusted in his speed, didn't try to gamble and, and take that run too early. <laughs> Beautiful night here, Catonsville, Maryland. It's cooled off a little bit. The day was even better, but at least there's not too much wind in this one. Forward and won't connect. Another chance for the kickers. Ooh. Take Strong that. to take that through the contact. Sent away for a corner kick. A lot of players would just go go down, but he wanted a goal. He didn't want a set piece. Got to respect that. Well, the one cr critique I have in the kickers of the past has been they create tons of chances but don't finish. It looks like they've remedied that today. <laughs> They're doing just fine on the finishing. Here comes delivery for the corner. It's a good one. Keeper stays oh. on his line. Off the post. Shouts for a handball. Oh, beautiful. Bicycle kick. What a flurry of activity. And yeah, we'll just come to a goal kick. Sent in quickly by Ambition. 
That is the second bicycle kick attempted by a kicker's player Man, tonight. They gotta give me one of these bicycle kicks so I can like put it in the highlights. I'll get it. <laughs> I'll send it into Sports Center and all that. I've had uh, clips blow up like that. We had uh, one get picked up by um, what's that? Uh, oh, that's a foul. Uh, Barstool Sports. Oh yeah. And like they completely ripped it from me and never gave credit. It was from one of my streams, and it got millions of views. I'll, I'll find it. I'll show you. It's... They didn't include the logo. They didn't include the logo. I put it on my channel in like the shorts section, mm -hmm. like just like oh, Barstool stole this from me, but. Nobody cares. <laughs> I, but I know it happened. It was a like a ball, like a dude, like it was a switch ball from like here to over, and the dude caught it on his back. Yeah. Turned around the player, and the dude got left like, in, and then he took it down, served it, and the only problem was he, the guy, his teammate didn't finish it. The goalkeeper made a nice save, but if he had finished that man, yeah, it would be even bigger. But it was crazy. This one's back. Yeah, kickers looking very good. Why are you not out on the pitch tonight, Mr. Patrick? I'm hurt today. You're hurt tonight? I'm, I'm You're chilling? I'm injured, yeah. Yeah, a couple of injured kickers up here in the studio. <laughs> Guaro and Medrano on the mend. <laughs> Pressure and sent out to the near touch. Good ball from us. Uh, yeah. Just ran out of real estate there. Let's see who's all time chimed in on the comments here. Good crowd here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, as the weather warms up, see more and more people come out. Here comes Ambition. Sending it back, and goalkeeper will deliver it one time. <laughs> Send it outside. turn in the midfield. Lots of space. Kicker's absolutely winning that midfield. Sent to the backside. Goalkeeper will confidently collect this one. Way too long for that one. Yeah. Too much juice on that one. Too direct. Here's Kareem. Running into yellow shirts. Lovely little delivery. Back pass is on. Here we go. Kickers are feeling themselves tonight. Can they deliver one across? Yeah, they can, on. but doesn't come to anything. Take a hit. Chance for a hit. And we'll just settle in possession. Sent across the 18. Back to where it came from. You're sending one in, it's oh. definitely on sides. Take well it. taken and stuffed. Shouts for a penalty and it is given. <laughs> Ambition don't like that one. <laughs> but uh, there was contact. The second penalty here for the kickers. Let's go up on the first penalty. Yeah, I haven't seen it. What'd you guys think? Look dangerous. Look dangerous? Yeah, like a dangerous play. <laughs> It was a kick, uh, a kicker's penalty. Like it, they yeah. got to take it, yeah. Yeah, but it was a dangerous play. But he did. Uh, Who's gonna take it for the kickers? Uh, Seems know, Carmo like, may Carmo be stepping up. Bole. He owes me one. Is he the normal kick taker? Uh, you guys switch it up. Switch it up a bit. Carmo potentially passing it along to oh. Sean here. Yeah, I love that. It's the, the passing of the guard. He's like taking him out <laughs> under his wing. Here we go. Here I'm gonna. Man, you got a lot of resistance on that. Yeah, I couldn't. <laughs> You're doing good. Here it comes. Who's the kick taker? A Sean. 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 Standing at the spot. Can he make it six? Oh. Goalkeeper oh, definitely came off his line, but it won't matter. <laughs> For his second goal of the night. 
I think so. Second one for Sean, 6 1 for the kickers. Disappointing for ambition, but to be fair, kickers have put their time in. They've spent their time in Division II and come very close to promotion. Uh, I'm not sure what's going on here. <laughs> and they are veterans. They are absolutely ready this season. They've been through it. Ambition, they got to put their time in. They'll certainly build into a comprehensive team. These y'all's fans. <laughs> I think that's ambitious players. Have to oh, okay. Leave a little early. <laughs> you beat the traffic. <laughs> uh, we have fun here at MSSL broadcasts. Goalkeeper down here taking very interesting positioning. Not so high off his line. <laughs> Sometimes as a goalkeeper, though, it's just not your fault. You're just like, you get scored on a bunch, but you can't really, like... So much you could do. I, I, for me, it bothers me more if I let in one bad goal and it's a one nothing game. If it's like mm -hmm. 7 nothing, I mean, you guys saw me at Cecil College. Yeah. I know, you know, about that. I like It was games where we got crushed and I was, like, happy with how I played or whatever. Like, or at least I was fine with it. But... Goalkeeper, keep your head high if you're watching this. Yeah, I don't know what the game's been like. Oh, wow, face. making the defender look like he's standing still. Is there a finish? And there is in the goal. It's another for the Baltimore Kickers, 7-1. I think that's the second goal. It's Who is that? Clay. Carmo Vole? No, Clay. Oh, Clay. Last name. You know, you don't know his last name. Yeah, I do. <laughs> Clay with a brace. Yeah, I don't even think he took it. I think it was just the momentum of his run and his speed took that one over. Clayton, Clayton. Clayton something. <laughs> nope, I'm not saying that one. Clayton come with the goal. Coom? I don't know. <laughs> Ambition. Well, they weren't shut out. They certainly have a lot of season left to get things going. We knew going into this, kickers one of the front runners, so they got to keep that in the back of their head. They have opportunities. Still haven't played Glenmont, which I think, honestly, from what I've seen, kickers are playing better tonight than they played against Glenmont. Glenmont, I feel like they weren't really, they could have scored more. Sent into the box. Right away, corner kick one. Good work from Sanjay Kareem. Yeah. Seems to be a player down for the kickers here. Yeah. Herman Sasha, who's played a great game tonight. Yeah, that'd be a huge loss. Hopefully, just a minor injury. And this would be a good time to sub him out. There's no need to keep any players on the field at this. Now, Patrick, you were actually in the huddle for the kickers at halftime. What were some <laughs> key points made by Coach Len? You know, um, I should have been here all of them, you know? <laughs> were you paying attention? I wasn't paying attention. He was not, yeah. yeah. Not, but, you know, I would guess he was telling the team to, you know, focus and, you know, slow it down a bit, you know? Yeah, there you go. And trust each other. You know that the entire kickers sideline and staff is going to watch this broadcast. <laughs> I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I think that was a setup. <laughs> <laughs> yep. There's the in swinger, Kareem. Looking near post. Ooh. There was a kicker's player, an ambition player there, but couldn't direct it on goal. Fake. Swings well out to John. Back to Eddie. Nico. I haven't seen much, but goalkeeper looks good. Is this a new goalkeeper? Uh, I think so. Yeah. I know y'all were looking for goalkeepers and such. Yeah. It looks good. Ooh. There's a oh, ball shit. in on sides. What? Oh, it's off sides. Uh, I don't know. That's, I, I don't know. That's, that's pretty close. <laughs> that's touch and that's, go, that's, but 
He was on. Benefit of the doubt, referees in the, in the position. On the line. Good ball over the top. With this win, and I do feel confident calling it a win, whatever happens here the rest of this game, I don't see kickers squandering this. They will move top of the table as NPC dropped today. There's a good ball across and another goal. What a finish. Beautiful goal. 8-1. Yeah, kicker's showing Play out tonight. <laughs> it's, it's all the Goal yellow. by Barrel. Who barrels a ball into the back of the net. Yeah, that was a beautiful ball across. And lovely little touch to take it over the goalkeeper. It looked like the keeper had it covered in the angle, but 8-1. Eight, one. Eight, one. What a statement from the kickers. AT switching the center backs up a little bit. It's about 10 minutes left in this game. Yeah. For your ambition, can you get one more just to show you're not out of the fight? For some reason, to me, 8 2 seems like a completely different story from 8 1. I don't know. <laughs> it seems like the fluke, the one goal wasn't a fluke, you know what I mean? Like, it's, yeah, you okay, actually got, yeah, yeah. Obviously, it's still a resolute win, a convincing win, but it looks a little better in my eyes. Like, good goalkeeping. Frustration possibly coming out. I didn't see the alleged kick out, but you can hear kicker's goalkeeper alleging that player kicked out at him after the play. Now, no, no. As a former goalkeeper yourself, is that quite common to see? Uh, I wouldn't say it's common, but in these situations, it gets more common. You know, when you're lo losing eight to one, I mean, it's the frustration comes what out. Ball. What a ball! Sent across, ball. unselfish, but offsides. Uh, I don't know about that decision, but it is what it is. Kind of close. I think he was well within his rights to take on the shot, but he went for the unselfish play, and it was the right play. Can't see from this angle. It was zoomed out too much. But... I don't understand. We have this beautiful stadium with all these stands, and then we got people who just stand on the track. Like, <laughs> oh my goodness, what a goal! For the Denaire. kicker is 9 1. Who's the goal scorer? Denaire. Denaire? Denaire. Is that his first or second, third? I think that is his first. First name. His first for Denaire. Hits the gritty right after. Denaire. With a celebration Man. as spectacular as his goal. Yeah. Man, I came and I guess. The floodgates have opened since I got, I mean, it was already opened a little bit, but. 9 1. 9 1. Since I've been here, I think, was it 5 1 when I got here? It was 4. It was 4, it was four when I got here. Yeah, I've seen five goals <laughs> in not long. What was the score at the half? 4 1. It was 4 three. 1. I got no, yeah, yeah. Was it 3? It was 4. No, it was 3 1. Playing a bit aggressive now. They want the ball. Yeah. This is time for the referee to. That's a, that's a fair challenge. I don't have a problem with yeah. that. Sent over the top. Yeah, the referee will have to watch out because he will start to see a little bit of frustration. It is in there. Kickers keep going. This might be offside. That one actually. That was it offside. That one might have been offside. I don't. That one was closer than the other one. The other one was definitely not. But. This would be a dumb time to get a red card, though. As much as they might be right, just yeah. let it go. You're going to win the game. Yeah. If you get a suspension, then that would really hurt for a game that you know you need players for. This is 
Clint into the corner now. Cuts it back. He's sharing the ball. And that is certainly going to be a card and a decision from the referee. See him drop the shoulders. There is the yellow card for an unnecessary challenge. Simmer dance. Get your boot back. AT here lining up for the free kick. There he is. Told you one to watch. Yeah, this is Pat's man to watch. <laughs> I was listening in on the drive up here. Yeah, the referee has to check things out. It's a good Sent ball. into the 18 and away. Not the kick we were expecting. We kind of built that one up a little bit. A little bit. <laughs> Very anticlimactic. <laughs> Maybe the next one. Let's see. Next one. Next yeah, one. yeah. I don't know how many next ones there will be. We're here in the 87th minute and something tells me we're not going to see a whole bunch of stoppage time in this. Uh, yeah. Who's your favorite player to watch? Uh, Henry? Yeah. The player to watch tonight has been the uh, new goalkeeper for the kickers, who may actually be uh, playing his debut game tonight. Oh, really? What's his name From again? From sources, Timmy Ostermeyer. Timmy Ostermeyer. Timmy Ostermeyer. Um, I support that pick, the goalkeeper. It's a bold move to pick a goalkeeper in an 8-1 game. Yeah. Oh, just wide. Good attempt Yeah. by John. The way they've been flying, it I thought that was going to bristle the back of the net, but just wide. What about your field player, Henry? Who's your who's your the wants player. to watch? Yeah. That would have to be between uh, Clay or Sean. Clay or Sean. Well, I think we're getting some... Or is he real kick? Decisions. I don't know how that one went against the kickers, but kept in bounds. Maybe even better, just letting that go over the touch. Ambition driving, miscommunication. Kareem wanted that one inside. See a new center back to ten. Oh. Henry, he's making you look bad. <laughs> That's what we call the commentator's curse. I see it. It's all too real. Oh, Kareem. A lovely little bit of skill, but doesn't quite come off. My man Pat's over here losing it. <laughs> <laughs> over whatever, <laughs> making me giggle now. It's a set piece for ambition. Sent up, the goalkeeper stays on the line and that's, well, further out. Hard to tell depth perception. It looks like a good set piece, but well wide. Yeah, they're mixing it up. Why not? Oh, making it interesting. Into the corner. And we'll get the goal kick. Honestly, I'd rather a goal kick than the handball. You know, more central. Overlapping run on here. Can they find him? Yes. Walking the tightrope, and ooh, there was a man in. Space out wide. That wasn't the move. But the pressure is stifling. Is there a service? There is. 
Oh, standing up with goalkeeper. So what a play. Oh, my goodness. The kickers had this pent up, I feel like, for some time. The frustration's on finishing, and now they're just making everything look like a touch of gold. Clay claiming a hat trick a this hat -trick. game. Well, the score, they messed it up. The kicker's name is too long, and now the one in the, <laughs> in the kick, Baltimore uh -huh. kickers is... <laughs> the scoreboard's not meant for that. We've officially broken the scoreboard with the double digits. Get some good highlights here. You know? Yeah. I wish they would stop, though, because every single goal means one that we have to edit. <laughs> you gotta chill now. <laughs> Oh, I just remembered that, dang it. Stop the matches, stop, stop. stop it. <laughs> Sent oh. in. Uh, that. Could it be another PK here? No, no, I think it's the foul on the goalkeeper. It could have been a back pass, an indirect kick, but yeah. he's not giving that at this point. He's just, it is what it is. <laughs> Trying to play out of the back. Oh my god. That is probably not the move it's not the, uh, at the moment. It's coming apart at the seams, but like I said, got to keep everything in perspective if you're ambitious. Yeah, tonight's not going your way, but you have a full season ahead of you. You have a lot to look forward to. Mm -hmm. Some easier opponents on the schedule, and you'll be ready the next time against the kickers. You know what to expect. Here comes an in-swinger for the kickers into stoppage time. We're going for the Olympico. Clay. Robbie. That's Clay. Winning the ball. Clay with the ball. <laughs> And wants the ball. <laughs> yeah, I say. This one switched over to the far side. And that is the final whistle. Kickers forcefully victorious by a score of 10 to 1. Thank you for joining us here on the channel DMV Sports Media. If you like what you saw, drop a like on the video and subscribe for more. We have Matches all week and all season will be covering the Maryland Super Soccer League. On Tuesday, we have Blazers versus Elite FC down in Virginia Super Soccer League, which is the sister conference of Maryland Super League. And then Wednesday, we got a triple header. Number one teams, Estudiantes versus Virginia Dream, top of the table battle. And then North Stars taking on Alexandria United. And of course, Villarreal Academy taking on Arlington SA. And then the fourth game on the channel on Wednesday night, Rostozzi and Christos in the finals of the DMV Cup from the winter. We'll look forward to seeing you on those. And then next week we got Saturday, all UPSL matchups, all night and day. And then Sunday, back to MSSL. So have a good night, ladies and gentlemen. Congratulations. This is the kickoff. Kicker's send-off, that is. And have a good night. We'll see you on the next one. All right, I'm going to go. Imagine how much, imagine how good they would have been with us on the field. On the next one. <laughs> <laughs> Great.